Welcome again to another episode of Hey Kitties Replays. Um, today I'm showing you a replay or a game I had with um, my clan. I was uh, fighting together with Scruff here in the OI, and on the other team there is another platoon from our clan. That's Isadora Vinian and Zulu Elite. Both Vinian and Zulu are supposed to be pretty good Hellcat players, same as me. So, we're going to see who's the best Hellcat in L7 and have a bit of a cat fight. I here went to one of the positions that I like to take, and as there was only one scout spotted so far, I aim at the usual. A scouting position and I'm wondering if I should take a shot so I'm aiming pull back so I have solid push in front of me and shoot. Maybe I hit a scout. That was what I was thinking. But nothing spotted by the egg. A scout might pull back after being hit. But now there are two light tanks in the middle so my shot was wasted. But you never know. Another thing why I went to one two line is um my clan or Zulu and Vinian are good players, Zelda as well, and I thought maybe they're defending one two line as a lot of bushes might be a possibility. Okay. Once go down and there's a heavy tank spotted. Um, one thing that you might see if you watch the chat, um, Scruff and I are communicating through platoon chat because the two of us and our other, uh, the other clan platoon were in the same team speak room, but we did not want to give away anything, as should be. And you will see that later on in, in the game that we didn't really care who we hit. We were indiscriminate about shooting our own people like because they are on the other side. So right now I'm watching if uh, and see if I can get any shots off now. So I'm progressing further using the bushes there. I don't want to get spotted. And there's Isildur from our clan. So I'm aiming. Uh, OI experimental. Okay. But as I hit the OI experimental, Scruff hit Isildur. So yes. And Isildur said thank you in team speak. And there I hit him. As you see, we don't mind taking out uh, each other. It was like. We were joking on TeamSpeak about yeah, taking out each other, fighting against each other. So, we are taking the don't tell the other ones where you are and everything serious there. We tried not to give away anything of the game, but still have fun while in TeamSpeak. You wonder why we ended up in the same game? Well, we did some counting in. like. One, two, three, better. Count down and everyone clicks better. Hoping that we might get on the same uh, team, which would give us a huge adva advantage in fight. But didn't happen. So we were fighting each other. Also okay. You see me progressing really slow here because I was like, Okay, if Isildur is over there and he's still alive and not a bad player, um, I thought, well, Vinian and Zulu are probably supporting him because that's what a platoon does. They're supporting each other. At least most of the time, or at least coordinating what you're doing, like uh, Scruff and me are doing here. Like I asked him, you got that? And he said, yes, I do, or I don't. I'm still reloading, that kind of thing. That's what you do in a platoon. 
so I can't see behind the bushes and I'm hoping the ELC spot something and there we go T40 shot Ooh, only tracked too bad but he's still there I can still shoot him he's tracked I hit him probably but yeah didn't kill him but our ELC got him okay I'm pulling back down to be hidden by the bush push forward in cover from the left hand side thinking that the elk would have spotted anything on my side of the road nothing here pull back to get into a bit more cover and I'm waiting for something to be spotted KV-85 he's on the other side of the railroad tracks no shot there but look who's there and look Isildur who wants to give you some laugh there me and I take him out and he did thank me for that like yeah thank you Ning, for taking me out thank you and I said yeah you're welcome so you see we are, we are having a lot of fun in our clan and mm, so I was like okay they, there's a lot of room in front of me where the Hellcats could be hidden but oh look who spotted there a Hellcat and there's room for only one Hellcat cat on this map and I miss and I was like okay let's tr try a blind shot but I didn't hit him too bad but now I know that he's over there so there can only be one uh, Hellcat up there in front of us and I don't like I didn't like feel that Hellcat, the Hellcats would split up there might be someone up front or not so I'm slowly pushing I want to get side shots and there's a little dip here that I'm going to use I've got solid bush on my left hand side so if there's no one in the bushes they are not going to spot me now I'm using this bush to hide my approach to be able to pull up soon as there's a fire they are going, probably going to spot me but for now I'm hidden and there's a hellcat spotted I don't have a shot so ah uh, but there's a scout I can blind them so that's what I do and pull back and that moment Scruff takes out Zulu well done there Scruff so there's only a Vinion left one Hellcat to go to decide the Hellcat or the cat fight here okay no hits on one two line and RT is pretty open so I decide well screw that I'm going to head down there um, try to get a few nice shots in maybe help the RG. I know there was a TD spotted on the hill so I might be able to get that one and there's an OI RT hit him someone did and there, there's you I'm trying to get shot on the OI without being spotted because I'm showing my ass to the enemy base there is still artillery there is a hacket that we don't know where he, it is at so I'm trying to not give away my position too much so now drop down from the hill again RT is dead but we need to take out the SU-85 and then we can take care of the OI he can't cap on his own we are a bit in an advantage here now there's a SU Scuff takes him out and there's a OI spotted low health side shot he's mine yes so Scuff and me are both on 4 kills now having carried the team there a bit and yes ah, I'm kinda like okay where could they be it we haven't spotted anyone there so first let's take out Artie and then let's go ahead hunt down the Hellcat, Vinion or 
uh, cap. I would RTB, but let's pick it off the base. Maybe one two line, but there was nothing spotted there yet, so either it's pretty well hidden, or it's on a 5-6 area, kinda. Or it could be on a 9-0. So I'm pushing over here, try to take a look, spot nothing, but ah, oh, I've been spotted, and okay, there's Artie. Aiming for it, but aiming and it's got taken out by the T-150. Oh, okay, so I've spotted but there were no shots fired at me, so the Vinian wasn't in a position to fire at me. But now we've spotted the Hellcat and I'm trying to shoot but I don't have a shot anymore. Okay, what can a Hellcat do? 250 two damage max, 260 I did that but it's rare. So I can take two or three shots, two, three shots most of the time. I don't spot her, so she didn't spot me. I'm moving in and decide, well, I need to be aggressive now. Do a drive by shot there, turn around, she's too slow. Get in another good shot, but the Panzer C4 took her out and shot right o uh, over me. So, yeah. Now let's take a quick look at the post game stats. Um, you see that Scuff and I both survived and got four killed, so we've got a Pothers in arms, which was pretty good. Um, as you see, I did a lot. Um, yeah, team score. I've got most base XP and Scuff finished second. On damage, he finished first and I second. Um, and our clanmates on the other team, Zulu finished second. Far behind the OI, um, Vinian didn't finish too good, and Isildur was one of the last ones. He didn't have a good game at all. But that was probably also due to their uh, scouts. The Crusader throwing away his life like that. So looks did a bit better. No, it was a layout, was it? Oh, well, we bo uh, both the scouts didn't do that much. So Leo, well, he did about 500 spotting damage, with, which is, yeah, nothing for a uh, scout. Taking a look at the detailed report, I fired 17 shots, hit 13 times and penned 10, so I didn't pen the shots on the OIs at some point. I have did 1,766 damage, uh, only 500 of them in close combat. That was uh, the two shots on Union uh, when I was circling here. Um, I've spotted two tanks, that's uh, the RT and I don't know what other, probably Union there. Um, I've damaged eight tanks, killed four, and allowed about 500 damage to be done. So, for me, it was a pretty good game. And as we were fighting Hell Kitty against the other two good Hellcat players in the clan, maybe it's decided who's the best Hellcat in the clan. Well, I leave it for you to decide. Hope you enjoyed watching, and see you next time. Bye bye.